Good morning my lovelies, today another new video, my gosh, so many of you asked me to make this video, 16 tips to take care of your clothes and keeping them for a very long time. Oh, I have so much to tell in this video, so I'm not going, to, I'm going to try not to talk too much, which is going to be very hard. This video is for you. If you are wondering how do I look after my clothes, because I got a few of you, obviously, with this job and Chanel, finally, and also I have to give you credit. So this video is created by me and scripting, but before we're jumping straight into the video, I want to thank you because during the year and a half I've been posting, you give me so many tips, so many recommendations that I answer to you hundreds of messages every morning. So thank you so, so much. This video is for you too. If you haven't done it yet or you don't know me, my name is Frederick. I'm not going to go too much in details because I need to jump into this video and making as short as possible. So visit my website, visit my Instagram. If I'm going too fast, everything will be linked below. And the most important, subscribe! Click, 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 click. Thank you so, so much. Now, let's start straight away. First one, it's actually not a tip. It's more like an intro that I completely forgot is buy less but buy more quality and even if you spend a little bit more money i can assure you you're going to take care more of them because they're like oh this top cost me 150 bucks so i'm going to take care when i'm washing it and also because when you wear something that is impeccable and good quality you have to admit ladies if it's good if it's better you're like oh i feel good today i feel fantastic by the way today okay let's start in 16 points are you ready washing machine i wash as much as i can on cold or on 30 degrees i always wash by color so i do a batch of white a batch of color and i wash my jeans separately oh that's my number two <laughs> jeans always try to wear your jeans as much as you can and try i know it sounds a bit gross not to wash them too much when you do wash them inside out always on cold water all right casual undergarment I'm not gonna go too much in details, whatever the fabric is, but again, tidy them by colors when you go to wash them. Some ladies have a special bag for injury, I don't actually, but I always wash them on cold or again, maximum 30 degrees. Because I talk about casual undergarments, you know? So the lingerie, the, the lace one, the one is very fragile, is beautiful wash them in a shower you have a shower you wash your face you have your little uh, culotte i want to say but it's not the word in english just string let's say or a beautiful lace bra wash very gently with a gentle um, soap let them dry like that not in the sun nothing that's what every french women do plus you will save the water and it will be much faster use those little bowls they are natural cedar. They smell wood, nothing special. I will stay away of naphthalene, especially when you're in a country like Australia. It's hot and humid. We have a lot of bugs, insects, and dangerous animals. But most important, it's nothing more annoying to have your favorite tea in cotton and you have a tiny, tiny holes, and it's almost brand new. So I've been testing them. Uh, downstairs with my coats in wool for the winter I put them in a little bag so I'm gonna see if it really works but I love them they cost really nothing I will do a full category in my Amazon shop how to take care of your clothes and I will list all the products all the thing I'm talking about before you jump on a comment and ask me so it would be on my Amazon shop personally I love folding my clothes so I got actually two things I like opening a wardrobe and see all the clothes by colors and style but for the jeans I don't put them on a hanger I don't know why, I like folding them and I got the dark jeans, the blue blue jeans and the white jeans. My point is fold everything, t-shirt, jumpers and if you have a really old jumper like I had one that I need to actually remove all the little balls but for the moment it takes so much room in my wardrobe I decided to put one in my bag to keep the shape of my bag so you have to do you know. But sometimes you forget you have that in your bag. <laughs> 
wash by hand anything is like super fragile such as cashmere wool merino and silk yes i wash silk by hand as well and when you do flat them dry and try not to be in the sun again depends in which country you are living if you're in australia you already know the rule how to remove makeup lipstick and foundation on clothes especially on your favorite white shirt even if you wear a bit of a powder you, you turn your color and then boom you're gonna have the marks i hate that as well you cannot avoid it but what you can do is to use a product that you can soak overnight in australian family have then i thought it was an australian product but actually i found it is dutch it's nappy sand it's like a little powder you're putting in the sink soaking excuse me overnight and then the day after no more stain so that really works so this is very good this is the same point by the way another product that i really really love to use is called sard wonder it's like this white stick i don't use too much nappy sand but in my color of my shirt so anything i will put makeup drive me insane so the sard wonder i was gonna put a little bit on the collar before putting in the washing machine and pretty much it does a good job so really again it will be in my amazon uh, shop when you finally washed and everything when you put your shirts on the on the hanger please try to close as close as you can on the top to be sure that it doesn't lose the shape and as well we recommend to use the same hangers for everything i love the wood one because i bought them long time ago and i don't want to buy a new one because it's fashionable because but it takes a little bit more room otherwise you can have the very flat one the one is velvet um they're good i got quite a few here as well but they're not they're super light and it's not my favorite i like the wood one but be sure that your wardrobe is really consistent and uniform and looking professional like a stylist because you are a stylist number 10 and i have to thank you for that because so many of you told me but get one get one and i'm like oh i'm not sure if it's really working if you've been following me for a long time you know i hate our running like crazy so i bought a steamer i did a lot of research i thought i don't want to spend too much money uh what looks i bought it in amazon actually and you plug it i like because it's a small size so i thought if i have to travel one day i can do, put that in my suitcase it heats within a minute and i tried on everything even the hardest fabric to iron such as linen you know linen got the crease so usually I'm, where I'm, I'm using it before I'm filming when I do all my fashion and styling videos and I got my clothes hanged and I'm like <laughs> it takes a very long time but it's, it's a really good one it's not very expensive don't remember the price but again I'm gonna find that because it's in Amazon and then I always use it sometime when I don't know what I'm gonna wear and in the morning I'm like I want to be creative like a shirt like I just did and I steam just before in the camera or sometimes because I never never wear a shirt that is not around girls I don't know why it's probably come from my education but always like neat neat for pants and skirt I don't have skirt personally only one and it's folded skirt you can have a hanger you know with a little pinch like that little pegs but they give marks on the skirt which I don't like or for the pants I bought quite a new one I got the hanger with the wire like that so I can put few of them on the same thing absolutely love it again we've been the Amazon shop and it keeps so much it saved me so much room in the wardrobe I just thought why didn't get that earlier absolutely love it so get that for your pants so you can get a fabric shaver so at the beginning I wanted to try the manual one which I got them again everything is from Amazon and I'm like okay but be careful first of all it's time consuming and if you use it on the some on the jump pad it's very fragile uh, like a cashmere or wool or your favorite one don't go crazy because you might remove so much wool and so much the little balls you know <laughs> you might have no jumper anymore left <laughs> So be careful. I've seen as well um, some people talk about the electric shaver thing, you know. And I order one from Philips. It's a small one like that. And unfortunately, I can't show you because I haven't received it yet, unfortunately. So I'm so sorry. But I know I got my favorite cashmere, even the manual one. And I use with the manual shaver. I'm very careful. And by the way, do it before you have to clean the house because it's gonna stay, it's gonna put a little bit of fluff everywhere. So do it when you have to vacuum the house after. 
trust me this is a good tip personally i don't have a dryer or i never don't have a dryer in years but again living in australia and i really love my clothes drying with fresh air so i have like a dryer i put outside i put my all the clothes are inside out even a simple white tee and i'm trying not to in a direct sun or if it's in a direct sun i know the sun's going to turn over whereas here it's really really hot and you don't want to get your favorite t-shirt it happens to me and you have a white line in the middle because it's being discolored by the sun if you have a dryer i do believe you can get those natural balls but I, again i'm not gonna be too long on that because i never use it when you wash your jumper your favorite one the fragile one and you soak off water even if you like really squeeze the water as much as you can and you dry that outside dry that flat because vertically is going to deform it because the water is going to have some weight trust me but it's a good tip if your jump pack get a bit too small and you try to extend it then do it <laughs> i've done that too insane if you dry cleaning your clothes please remove put in the bin those wire hangers i hate them they're so cheap they will deform damage your clothes but on the other hand with the dry cleaner for example if you have coats or something you're not going to use for the next season you can keep the plastic and protect it like that number 15 you're gonna love this one <laughs> don't cook with white clothes or even expensive fabric because i can assure you the balsamic vinegar your favorite red wine or even if you brush your teeth with you know with those charcoal powder to supposedly to get your teeth whiter they will come to you your shirt you will try to be super careful and they will do when it happens you are allowed to curse but curse everything and if you have kids around curse in your head but cursing will make you feel better okay cursing then run usually you're in the kitchen so you don't have to run if it's uh, uh, wine put some salt on it and use again the nappy sand or any brand that you know that you trust that you can soak uh, bicarbonate of soda i need to find the name in english sodium bicarbonate maybe that works fantastically and maybe at the end we have to be like a grandmother wearing your apron or not cooking at all or just wearing your craziest i don't want to say something more thing t-shirt to cook i don't know but i know personal experience every time i wear a white shirt and i cook so now i'm avoiding it that's it and when i cook it's not even good food but that's another question anyway number 16 if you don't know if you got an accident about stain and you're not sure because you know it's so complicated you think you're gonna remember but tomato sauce you're not treating the same as a wine stain google it don't believe what i said google it be quick do not rub before you sure about it and i hope you enjoy this video please uh, tell me know in comments if i forgot about something if you know a very good tip how to take care of your clothes thank you so much for watching subscribe click 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 why am i screaming i have no idea i love you kiss 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 bye 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 see you to the next video until then take care of yourself ciao ciao